Las Vegas, 1019 The Wolf. We're here with Drake White. How are you doing this morning, sir? Good, good. How are you doing? Not too bad. Is, is this your first time in Vegas? No. 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 We've been, <laughs> there's a we've story. We've been here there. multiple times. You know, I've, I've, uh, I, I consider myself a nomadic soul, so I, I came out here before I was uh, in the music business, but definitely with the music business, I've been out here a couple of Maybe half a dozen, eight times. Oh, wow. Like okay. So, so, yeah, you're familiar. Yeah. I mean, it's entertainment capital of the world. It so. really yeah. is. Yeah. So, uh, yeah. So, Living the Dream is the new single. Yep. So, tell us a little bit about it. Living the Dream is just one of those tunes that, you know, it's got a cool groove to it. I'm, I'm a groove kind of oriented guy. That's what really pushes my ears to, to, to great music. And But what this song says is really what turned me, and, and it's... It kind of says, you know, cling on to the things, the, the things that are important, which is your family and the things that you love, the, the little simplistic things in life. And there's so much crap out there today and, and so much going on that I think we get kind of disillusioned by all the information. And, yeah. and this song just kind of brings you back to the, the simplistic things in life and, uh, and uh, just kind of encourages you to, to take it easy and, and live the dream. And, yeah. and uh, it's, uh, it's, it's great. I really dig it. Now, when you're talking about live like kind of the simplistic life, like, are there ever times where you just unplug, you put your phone away, and you just you're like, it's me and my guitar, or me and a radio, or something sure. like that? Yeah, I've got about five acres north of Nashville, and uh, we were just talking about it. They were talking about Snapchat, and and, <laughs> and I've heard Snapchat is great, but I'm not, I'm not a big Snapchat type dude. You know, I, yeah. I obviously know my my social networks are uh, very important to my career, and yeah. I get that. That's your job. That's my job, and I and and I love my fans that are on there and, and, and uh, like communicate with them in that nature. But to, to unplug, to truly unplug for me is to get out in nature and, and really see the sunrise, see it go down, build a fire, you know, catch some fish, hang out. And the, the true, so, the, you know, the first social networking was around a fire. You know? Yeah, right. <laughs> that, was, that was social networking. So that, that is my speed. That is my type of uh, my forte and my type of lifestyle that I prefer. But um you know i i love music and i love i, I want to help people with my music and spread it out so that uh it kind of it's the push and pull of that and the balance of it you know? well it makes all the sense in the world that you're going on tour with the zach brown band because yeah. they have that same kind of groove yeah it's just like it's chill it's relaxed yeah. um how do you feel about the tour oh god man I'm, I'm i'm just elated you know i mean we're so excited about we, we love them as a band they're one of the best bands out there and, and some of the most giving guys and humble guys out there. And they're so open to, to, to giving us um, advice, yeah. which is so I, I look at it like a, a classroom. You know, we, we get to learn from uh, masters that, that are doing what we want to be doing eventually. And uh, so to, to be able to go out there and do 40 shows with them in, in 2016 is a, a dream come true. Yeah, that sounds great. Now you mentioned fishing earlier, so I gotta ask, what's the biggest fish you ever caught? Ah, the biggest fish I ever caught was probably, probably a shark. You know, a shark? in the Gulf <laughs> somewhere. You know, uh, probably a, you know, probably 100, 150 pounds. Oh my like god! That. Wow. Oh, only uh. <laughs> yeah. Only yeah. Is there but a one that got away story? Like, is, do, do fishermen nah, have that story nah, where you're just I mean, like, man, that was the one? Yeah, music's kind of what's what's taking all of my fishing time away but oh. I, I, I let it do it but you know i i consider myself more of uh, you know an avid outdoorsman is like more of a hunter than i do a fisher but I, I do love fishing so i don't have any huge great fishing stories but <laughs> yeah. i do i did catch the salmon run in alaska one time and oh that was, that would be cool. wow, that that's was amazing. uh and i did go to new zealand one time so i guess i do yeah, have a great story so. yeah, we just watch the bears in the salmon run there's a yeah. live feed you can just watch them yeah so I, that's I watch as far it every as year. close as we the, get the ultimate fishers there yeah, yeah exactly well thank you so much man for taking the time we appreciate it 2016 looks like it's going to be insane for you so we're excited for you my pleasure thank you